Hey beautiful people, welcome or welcome back. I'm Josie with Awakened Soul. If you're new here, we are here to see what your person's current thoughts and feelings are about you and your connection. We're going to get started by pulling a few tarot cards to talk about their thoughts and feelings. We will also get out some cards on their intentions towards you. So what may be coming next from them. Talk to me about this person's current thoughts and feelings, please. Too many, too many. <laughs> okay, there we go. Justice, interesting. Let's get a clarifier on that. There we go, that came out right away. They're like, all right, we'll do. We also have the fool. Okay, to clarify justice, let's get out a few more cards. Okay, we have the Wheel of Fortune turning something around. This person's having an honest desire to have a new beginning with you. That's what I'm seeing here. They feel like there has got, something has gone majorly wrong in this connection, okay? Now, that could be accurate or not. Um, this person could also be a bit of a drama queen or a drama king, okay? They feel like something major has gone wrong. They want a fresh start. They want to turn things around, okay? We have the Ace of Swords. They want to talk about the truth. They want clarity. They want to know what the heck's going on here. We also have the Devil. Now, I want to note that so far, I've only gotten five cards out. Four out of the five have been Major Arcana. So again, this person is feeling super sensitive. They're very dramatic right now. They're intense. Like the intensity of their thoughts and feelings are through the roof. Um, so maybe something very serious. <laughs> <laughs> has happened recently. Hi, Wally. Okay, talk about drama queen. Anyway, but um, <laughs> they want truth and clarity. Like this person's feeling very stuck on you right now. They want to turn things around. They're like over dramatizing this. I mean, maybe something serious did happen between the two of you recently, but they're like ultra serious about it right now. And they want to know what the heck's going on and they want to turn things around because they're burdened as heck right now. They feel a heavy weight on their shoulders. They feel like a dense heaviness, like everything is on their back. Maybe they really screwed something up. I don't know. Um, I don't feel like they're projecting this towards you. I don't feel like it's something that you did necessarily. Maybe it's something that you said that pointed something out to them and it really got their gears going and they're thinking about it. Um, but basically they have a heavy weight on their shoulders. They feel like something major is going wrong right now. They want to turn it around. They want to spin that wheel in the opposite direction, get clarity and have a new beginning with you. So that's what's going on with them mentally and emotionally. I wanna see what their next moves towards you are going to be action chariot we have the chariot coming out they are going to make a move towards you um i just heard i don't want to say goodbye so i don't know what that's all about maybe you tried to break up with this person or something like that i don't want to say goodbye hmm. okay nine of pentacles this person might want to gift you something share something with you you make this person feel abundant or maybe they want to bless you with literal abundance they want to give you a gift um something like that possibly let's get one more card or two the nine of swords their intentions i feel like there's like a correction yeah this person feels guilty about not having a lighthearted energy in this connection and they want to fix that. Maybe this person feels like they hurt you really bad. Ten of Cups, yeah. What this is telling me is this person's next moves towards you are going to be correct to correct something that's gone wrong, essentially, and bring in some type of a celebratory energy, okay? Because they feel this heaviness between the two of you. They feel like they hurt you pretty bad. Okay, especially at night, maybe the two of you got in an argument at night or they know you're thinking about them late at night or something like that, or that you haven't been able to get to sleep or something because of stress and worries. They want to bring in a lighthearted energy and celebrate something with you. Um, and they want this connection to level up and continue to move forward because we have the Ten of Cups rounding out this spread. The Ten of Cups is a card of like a happily ever after type of relationship connection. There's an abundance of love, an abundance of material resources as well. This person is planning on this co connection continuing and fixing whatever this is that's gone wrong between the two of you. So anyway, let's get out a message or two from them and then we are going to carry on, okay? Let's continue onward. 
Talk to me about what this person would have to say right now, please, if they felt like they could. If you've been resonating with this, don't forget to like and subscribe, okay? Self-love, I'm still trying to heal. Could be that this person has carried some stuff over from previous relationships, and they're aware of that, and they know they have to do some more work on themselves, okay? What else would this person say? Irreplaceable. The way you love can never be matched. This person adores you, okay? They really do. They really do. They don't want to lose this connection. They want a fresh start. They don't want an ending to happen. They want a new beginning. They know that you're the one for them. They know that this love is irreplaceable, that they will never, ever find something like this again in a million years. They don't want to let it go. Um, they want to spin things around. They want to fix it from what I can see here, okay? So let's get you out a message now. Now, it could relate to this connection or not. I always leave this ending of my readings open-ended for the viewer and whatever you need to hear the most. Okay. You are more. Rise above your challenges is what I'm feeling called to say. You are more than meets the eye. It's time to rise above your challenges. You're a beautiful soul, and I hope you know it. Get you out your affirmation of the day. If you feel like claiming this, comment it down below. Here is your butterfly and your affirmation is, it is safe for me to explore unknown worlds and try new things. Love that. I don't know if I've ever seen that one in this deck yet. I am going to leave this reading here today. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you have yourself a beautiful and blessed day. And until next time, bye for now.